Hello everyone, this is ZombieHunter867 and welcome back to Batman Arkham Origins. This is part 27. And so this is interesting how it reset all of this. I don't need to take out that sniper. But it would probably be safer for everyone if I took out that sniper. As in citizens and police. But I like how it it adjusted that crate there to make it where uh, much of it where where it's closed. There we go. So what are we gonna work on? I guess because that's black mass. So we're going to work on solving some crimes. That should be fun, right? Right. All right. And I can't remember if I already said this, but don't be surprised if Miles starts meowing because he has been, look at those criminals, so unsafe to be on the ice. But hey, that's their choice. But anyway, anyway. Miles is in a very talkative mood. So do not be surprised if he starts meowing loudly. Very, very loudly. So, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Um, let's see, what do we need to do? Like, like, I know what we need to do, but where do we need to go? And I guess I'm going to go around here. Probably, it would have been faster in the long run to use fast travel. Because they have this huge building in the way. So not fun. To have to get around that one. You can't even go ab above it. If you could go above it, that would be great. But enough of me ranting about it. <laughs> so we have to. Police know the victim fell from a nearby building, but there's not much else in the file. His identity might shed some light on things. Ryan Murphy, an account manager at the Gotham Merchants Bank. Cause of death, internal injuries sustained on impact. Now I know what happened. Time to find out how and why. Blood spatter indicates a high velocity impact. I should check the roof. Miles, that's rude to interrupt Batman. Well, the railing here is broken. Was it an accident or was he pushed? He was probably pushed. Huh. Two sets of footprints means the victim wasn't alone. And the scattered paperwork suggests he had a briefcase. I need to find that. Oh, it's just there. Interesting. There are two sets of fingerprints here. One belongs to the victim, the other to Robert Haynes, a well-known con artist. Alfred, I need the last known location of Robert Haynes. I'll send over everything I've got in case it helps. 
No need, sir. I already have a search area. Check your display. Alrighty. That's going to be the fastest way to do that. Hi, Miles. I see you staring at me. Cats, I tell ya. <laughs> I just looked back over at him and he instantly looked away. As if he was going, Oh, I, I'm, I'm not watching you. I'm not, I'm not staring at you. Don't mind me. We know where you're up to, Miles. You're plotting my death. And yes, that escalated quite quickly, didn't it? What do you think? I can make the IDs, but you sure it's gonna work? I've got the account numbers and passwords. If we've got driver's licenses that say we're the guys, then as far as the bank's concerned, we're the guys. Yeah, but what if they uh, recognize one of us? I specifically chose clients from out of town. Most of them have never set foot inside the bank. All right, but if this goes pear-shaped, it's on you. Relax, guy. I've been doing this a long time, and I never make mistakes. Okay, Mr. Con Artist, you're going down. <sighs> Fighting, not my strong suit in the Batman game. Really not. Oh my gosh, I am. There we go. Shot gloves. Bail me out. Why do they have so much health? I thought I was gonna kick him over the side. What do you want? What happened to Brian Murphy? We had a deal. He gave me the account numbers. I faked being a client and cleared out the account. In exchange, he gets a cut. It's a con I run a hundred times. But then he starts to get nervous, tries to back out. So you threw him off a roof? I couldn't risk him warning the bank or going to the cops. I had to protect my interests. And how'd that work out for you? Alfred, contact the GCPD and let them know Brian Murphy's killer has been apprehended. Send over the evidence as well. Consider it done, sir. Ah, uh, poor Murphy. All right. What's next? Let's go here. Criminal locked. Hmm. So that's black mask. Okay. So apparently it's not going to give us another case. Hmm. All right, well, we're going to take out this radio tower. Yeah. Area has been secured and prepped. Requesting a detective on site ASAP. Copy 37. Delta 4 1 has been assigned. Okay. We have another case file. So we'll do that momentarily though. We're going to take out this radio. I hate you made the right decision. Recognizing when you've been you beaten is I the see? first step on the road to self-improvement. This is ooh.
Okay, so there aren't any other snipers. What? Where? Oh, Enigma. We are gonna have a nice chat. Brains always triumph over brawn, my friend. Always. Alright, so I will say that I died a second time. Second time ever to Enigma. And I am furious, but I know the location of, uh, of the sniper. Bye-bye, guys. Bye-bye. Now I'm going to take out these guys in peace. Oh, no, it's him. I dodged that, but okay. Ah, oh, it feels good to be fighting them without having the sniper shooting at me. He should have gotten up. I'm afraid you'll find I've stepped things up considerably. Which means I think our time together is growing too close. It's been fun that day. I thought you had a city to save. So what are you doing wasting time with me? I already saved the city. I, I will agree with with you. I was sure you'd fail. No one is this lucky. You need to stop this. Stop what? Cleaning up the streets? Ensuring the GCPD actually does its job? Removing corruption from the system? Was it one of those in particular you took issue with, or all of them? You're using the data you've stolen to blackmail people. So? It gets the job done. It's certainly kinder than the beatings you're so fond of doling out. Think on that. He might have a point, but I'm not going to give it to him. Instead, I'm going to go to Amusement Mile. And we're going to... Come on. There we go. I'm going to go here. It's still selected, and then we're going to fast travel. Because we need to speed this up. There we go. How am I still getting glide with all those holes in my cape? I've never had such a bad looking cape before. Loading in the crime scene, good, good. According to the police report, the victim died from a single gunshot wound to the chest. But who killed him, and why? Examining the body should provide a lead. Owen Grant. He's an investigative journalist. Did an interview with him last year. Must have been chasing a big story to be out here. Now there's a camera strap around his neck. But where's the rest of it? The 
This trail indicates the victim tried to escape before succumbing to his wounds. Spatter analysis indicates the shot came from below. Grant must have dropped the camera when he was hit. Reviewing the reconstruction will help me find it, assuming the shooter didn't get there first. some data taken from a camera. See if you can ID the subject in the shots. Certainly, sir. Just give me a moment. Uh, here we are. Mm. Uh, one Chucky Burks. I'm sending you his last known location. All right. And where is he currently? Back here? Yep, he's back there. All right, let's fast travel again. Jump on the next bus out of Gotham. You're done here. Look, if they've showed up, fine, we walk. But if they haven't, if there's still time, then please, I'm begging you. And I'm telling you, forget it. You think they won't trace this back to you too? Huh? Find out about our little counterfeiting scheme? What do you think that guy was doing down there? Sightseeing? They're already on to us. How the hell that happened? You tell me. I'm not the one buying flashy cars and no suits. Buying rounds for everybody at the bar. Hell, you've even got an entourage now. I don't know what you're talking about. Sure you don't. Either way, it looks like if I go down, you go down. Give me a minute. I need to think about this. You don't have a minute. Oh. Nice. What do you want? Justice. You killed a man. Why? He was going to expose our counterfeiting. I didn't have a choice. You always have a choice. Oh. Alfred, let GCPD know that Chucky e. Burks has been apprehended for the murder of Owen Grant. Send them my current location along with the case file details. At once, sir. Alrighty. Well, I would say that would be the, that would be it for this episode. Ooh. So the fire's almost out, but it looks like we've got a body here. Cause of death currently unknown. Gonna need a forensics team to take a look. Copy that. We'll get someone to you. Keep the site secured until they arrive. All right. We have our next thing for our next episode. So thank you guys so very much for watching. Be sure to rate the video on whether or not you liked it or disliked it. I do not mind either or because it has feedback. I like feedback. If you have a thought or suggestion, be sure to post it down in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, why not subscribe for more like it? And with that, I will see you all next time.